Hi there, folks. This is Chase. I'm that guy with the gloves, and you know my broadcast partner, M. Bison. Here it is, guys. These are the results of the fan art giveaway contest. Oh my god, I am brimming with excitement. If there's one thing this contest has taught me, it's that you all love me! Mwah! Well, I love you too, baby. So many wonderful drawings of Big Papa Bison. I hope he doesn't start calling himself that. You guys, you guys rock. Now let's take a look at the contest entries. Oh, I wonder who it's gonna be first. Ah, it's me. I love this drawing here by Brayden. Such wonderful colors. Very, very lifelike. That's going above my toilet. Ugh. And I love this drawing here by It Solomon. Seriously, great skills on this thing. I love the way you made Daniel Bryan look and me with my mutton chops. Uh, there's his Instagram handle. I like this one too here by Brian. Love the black background, kind of a minimalist design, but really cool. It's sort of reminiscent of the NWO logo. I like it a lot. Oh, look at this drawing. This one's by Bobby Lashley. Is, do you think it's the real Bobby Lashley? Well, it could be. I love the I love this one. This one's seriously cool. And <laughs> oh man, this one's awesome. Here we Foley for the win. Now why am I a unicorn? I should be riding it. I should be riding a flaming unicorn. Uh, whatever, Bison. This one is by uh, YXW Animation. Oh, I have a little cookie on my shoulder. I'm gonna eat it. Now this one is done by Keith. Um, I actually got a, a couple of different ones from him. This is just the one that I chose for his contest entry. Uh, he sent me another one, this one here. I, I like it too, it's a good play on the, on the new Burnout Inc. Pro Wrestling logo. He also sent me a channel trailer, which is going to be sort of towards the end of the video when you see the actual video entries. Aw, oh, look at this cute little drawing of me by Alex. Look at my knee pads. They're righteous. Yeah, I showed that one to my fiance. She really liked how Bison's knee pads looked. Uh, this one here is by Manoli. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing your name right. Very cool. I love the font choice. This really looks great. Uh, I like the filter, too. Damn, look at this thing by Joshi. Yeah. This thing is really freaking cool. I, I love how it just crowded and the amount of space you're able to use on that poster. Oh, uh, who's this by? Dylan WWE Figures. That's right. Match of the year. Me versus that horse face knacker. Oh, oh, wow. We're getting into this. I got this really cool sign here from Nathan. Oh, man. This thing's really cool. I love the explosion effect on it. Hashtag fig life. Uh, this one here is by Billy. Oh, this one's really cute. It kind of reminds me of Christmas. Bison, what doesn't remind you of Christmas? Uh, mass genocide. That reminds me of my birthday. And we have another uh, Jim versus Bison poster here. Really cool. Thank you, Chandler. This looks really great. And then A99. I love this one, man. I like how you did the glove thing on there. That guy with the gloves. That's really cool. And Bison over there looking creepy as he should. Oh, look at Look at this really cool meltdown poster by Charlie. He's got all the main players on there, except me. Well, I said you didn't partake in any matches. No, but I did get super kicked by Shawn Michaels. Yeah, that was cool. And then Jack sent me this, uh, or he sent us, he sent this really nice poster here. It's got me and Bison with a picture of my, of my gloved hand on there, looking badass. Oh man, this is outrageous, Nick. Seriously, this is awesome. And look, I look evil and menacing. Badass. And then this is sent by my good friend on Instagram, Matthew the Sausage. Uh, did sort of a South Park looking character like me, which is actually really cool because South Park's one of my favorite things and I used to doodle South Park characters all the time. And then uh, at, I think it's Aids OK on Instagram sent me this nice little drawing of me and Bison. It's really cool. Uh, this one is from Noah Side Effect on Instagram. I, this thing is really cool. I love this poster that he made. Aw, and I see you're trying to consult Jim after I laid the smack down on him. Uh, this one is by SoccerBoy1067 on Instagram. Again, thank you. This is a really cool poster. I like all the little social media things. Uh, this one's really cute. This one was sent by ShadowClaw900. I love, yeah, this one's really cool. I think it's one of the only ones that looks like Crayon that was sent to me, and I, that one really stood out. Uh, this one is by TNW Customs on Instagram. Uh, me versus Bison at WrestleMania with Wadfigs as the guest referee. Really cool. This one is by EWE Network. Loving the, the Fallout mashup and the font choice. Really badass. 
this one. Uh, showing some love to the dead man. This is by BM Figs on Instagram. Oh, this one's really cool. It's a nice mashup of all things BPW. And I got this pretty cool looking sign here from Ambrose Coop Writer on Instagram. I love the black background. It's as black as my heart. And then this one is by Christian Joseph. Oh, look at Rusev. I just want to hug the little guy. And then Dean Ambrose up there looking like a sick psychopath. This one's really cool. I got this from WAW Network on Instagram. I really love the font choice that he did for uh, the BPW Burnout Inc. for wrestling up at the top. And the Photoshop elements are really cool. Uh, this one is from True Quitstro from, um, on Instagram. Sorry about that. I like it. It's really freaking cool, man. And here we have one from Stefan Gruny. Oh, we got Daniel Bryan, Seth Rollins, and I'm guessing that's Stone Cold Steve Austin. I'm pretty certain it is. I mean, he is bald. Not all bald people are Stone Cold Steve Austin. I can, uh, Smile More showed me his badass Dean Ambrose Joker custom. Uh, it's based off of something I did on one of my streams, and I think that's really cool. Aw, and Alex Edits showing up with this cute little poster here. Thank you, Alex. This is neat. Green mustache. What the hell is this all about? Oh yeah, this is from uh, King WWE Fan 12. Um, I sort of went on a little tirade on Instagram regarding a Los Matadors figure, and then we have this really cool little comic strip drawn by Noah the Kid 64. Why do I look like that? I don't wear a mask. Well, Bison, you are ugly. Hey! Ah ha 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 ha! Brayden Patrick with the win. Look at him pushing. Look at me pushing down Wad Figs. That's right, he deserves to be below me. Yeah, well, look at this drawing here by uh, DF Wrestlings. You're you're below me on this. Yeah, but I'm slowly raising my hand so I can just throttle your neck. Yeah, whatever. And then straight out of awesomeness comes DJ, uh, DJ Josh MD. This nice little Burnout Ink poster. Thanks again, man. Sort of a play on the straight out of Compton thing. I like it. And then uh, KP Figure Reviews on Instagram. This cool little drawing of me in my figure form. I like the detail on the joints. Really awesome. Oh, look at the hellfire. And look at the cape. This is by Justin on Instagram. Oh, yes. I'm hanging this one above my toilet, too. And then I got this really nice little letter here thing from a WWE Elite Figure Collector. I couldn't read most of it just because, you know, it's kind of hard to see the, the font and stuff like that. But again, thank you very much. And then I got this nice little sign here from Danny. Uh, me and Bison with little stick figure drawings of us. That's pretty cool. And then we have this pretty good looking drawing here from Jackie Cosplay and Drawing. I'm not certain who the person in the picture is supposed to be, but it says Burnout Inc. on there. Pretty cool font choice. Thank you very much. And then Jonathan showing up with this really cool poster. Ah, oh, yes. The Stormtroopers. Why are you on there twice? I should be on there twice. Bison, come on. And... Hey, look at this. Loving it. Looks like a Jackson Pollock painting. Uh, okay. Uh, this one is by Jack B. It's really cool. All right. Now we're getting into the channel trailers and videos. This one is by Bryce. You can obviously tell by the credit up front. I love the music choice on this thing. Um, I'm pretty certain this was made using an iPhone or an Android app. And the background designs are really cool. Like this, the transitions and the title effects. You know, very kind of 300-esque vibe that I'm getting from here. Was that Kratos? Uh, yeah, Bison, that was Kratos. He's never showing up to Burnout Inc. for wrestling, is he? Well, I don't know. I mean, he's a god of war. He can pretty much go wherever he wants to. Oh, I don't like this. Now, this is another thing that was sent in by Keith. Um, now, even though I did like the drawing, that the first drawing that he did more, I still wanted to show off this uh, channel trailer that he made, because it's really cool. Very reminiscent to the same one that Bryce made in terms of uh, how the pictures and stuff are done, but still, I really like it. It's different, and I love the choice of music. It's really epic. Yes! Listen to that pulse pounding. Oh look, Trace, the Loot Crate unboxings. Why don't you do those anymore? Uh, mostly because they just don't get views. Ah, I see. Everything you do is just about the views, is it? Well, it's kind of a big motivating factor when making videos for YouTube, Bison. Well, why don't you just do whatever you want and put it on YouTube and just let the people judge for themselves? Well, if you're unhappy with something I'm doing, why don't you do a YouTube channel yourself? Why are you smiling? Where are you going?
Bison? Okay, well, Bison took off. I don't know what he's up to. So then I got this awesome video by Caleb here. I uh, did a couple of really cool drawings, kind of mashed up into a slideshow. And there he is acting all awesome. And <laughs> yeah, it goes into it more. There was an outtake at the end, but that was really cool. Thank you, sir. All right, so now we're getting down to the prizes. Which ones did we like the best? So the winner of the Lita figure is WAW Network. I really like this one a lot, man. Thank you very much. Okay. Now the winner of the Demon Finn Balor figure is... Joshi. Absolutely love this one, dude. It's amazing. So now we're getting down to the grand prize. The Ringside Collectibles Kevin Nash. And the winner of that one is Nick. I really loved what you did here. Me, Bison, Punk, Balor, Sting, Brian, Stone, Cold Taker. Everything looks great on that, man. So congratulations. So I'm going to reach out to each and every one of you that won. And I'm going to send those figures out next Monday after I get paid. There was someone else on Instagram that sent me something. It was um, a Photoshop thing with it. It said Chase Arcade and there was like some fireworks and stuff going on. I unfortunately lost the photo with your handle on it. It was on my old phone and I got rid of it the other day. So I'm really, really sorry about that. If you see this video, please link me the picture on Instagram again. I'll give you a shout out and everything. I just felt really bad about missing it and not including it in this video. But thank you to everyone who entered this. This like seriously validated everything that I've been doing. The fan art contest to me just turned out great. This I think was the best contest that we've ever done. I loved everything you guys sent in. Like truly a lot of this stuff just touched me and I I can't even believe the talent some of you guys have. And I know Bison loved everything that was sent in too, especially all the drawings of him. So he really appreciates it. I really appreciate it. Guys, again, I can't say it enough. Thank you so much. All right, this was Chase from Burnout Inc. I'm that guy with the gloves. Again, thank you, thank you so much. We'll see you next time. Ultimate Warrior. Warrior has an amazing face sculpt. The paintwork is awesome. I love the details, even the little warrior symbol on his cheek. The chest emblem looks great. His attire is wonderful and colorful. Even though he does include a yellow winged eagle title, it should have been an intercontinental title, it looks insane. The Legend Series Warrior will run on forever.